Alfred Mavu Mwangi, and I'm the director of uh, St. John's School. We are fully prepared to take on junior secondary education. We have been putting in a new block since 2016 and it's now complete. We have all the facilities that are necessary, the rooms to uh, house the, <coughs> the laboratories are also complete and we believe that uh, in a three months time everything should be ready to roll on the curriculum of uh, the junior secondary education. Uh, we have enough teachers. We felt uh, that uh, the government uh, has been uh, uh, good to us or to the private school owners for allowing us to assist in this uh, program and uh, they know the school. All those who have come through here are well trained, most of them are in uh, good professions and besides uh, education we have trained them in uh, morals and ethics, good behavior and uh, no doubt all of them will turn out to be useful citizens and contributing to society. a teacher by profession, initially trained to teach high school, taught the great high school for nine years, then joined Upper Hill for a similar number of years before now coming to St. Joan School, uh, St. Joan School and uh, manage it. We, according to the Ministry of Education requirements for junior secondary teaching, we are fully prepared in that. We have a number of rooms, like over eight. We are preparing a laboratory, and we also have a music room, and a room for languages teaching Chinese and French. And we have two graduate teachers and three others are undergoing training in readiness and preparedness for junior starting of junior secondary school come January 2020. So we are targeting to start with the first one that is uh, grade 7. Come the following year we we'll go to grade 8 and then grade 9. And so we are hoping to accommodate like over 500 students when it gets to doing the junior national examination itself.
My name is Isabel Garuya. I'm a teacher at St. John's Primary School. As a teacher, I believe that yes, we are up to task in the implementation of the junior secondary education. Um, we actually have a building that we've already that has already been set up in preparation. In fact, the building is complete. So we are up to task. We have acquired materials such as the curriculum designs for the same. And um, of course, there is all the, the, the practical training. We go through different sorts of training. We have facilitators who take us through the CBC syllabus.